In order for the paper sensor to tell the difference between the label itself and the gap between each label, it has to measure the amount of light that passes through the material. This amount is measured as a voltage. If these values are thrown off for some reason, which includes doing a factory reset, it may be necessary to restore the correct readings again. This can be done fairly easily. As we have done already several times, we begin with the printer turned off. On the back of the machine, we will turn on dip switches 7 and 8. Next, we will need to open the printhead and lift the upper part of the paper sensor. Instead of using label material, this time we will want to put only the label liner into the sensor. Once the liner is properly positioned and the top of the sensor is locked down, then the printhead can be closed. While holding down the feed button, turn on the printer. The power light alone will come on. Next, press the feed button once. Notice that the power light goes out and the online light turns on. Then, press and hold the pause key until the online light starts blinking. This blinking light indicates that the liner voltage has been reset. To finish the adjustment, we need to establish one more value for the sensor. To do this, first press the feed key once. Both the power and online lights will come on. Lift the upper paper sensor arm. Remove the label liner from the sensor and close everything down again. This time we will be setting a value with no material in the sensor at all. Press and hold the pause key until both the power and online lights are blinking. The printer can now be turned off and the dip switch is restored to their normal positions. You now know the basics of running a Tech B452 printer. You have learned how to position the upper and lower paper sensor and how to load media in the machine. You have also learned about setting a threshold for running multicolor labels. In addition, you have learned some simple troubleshooting techniques that may be helpful in resolving some printer specific problems. Should you need additional help, the Technical Support Department at Century Systems is prepared to offer our expertise in evaluating any printer problems you may encounter.